a feast for crows. Although sometimes overlooked, it is underrated and maybe the most important of George R.R. R. Martin's Song of Ice and Fire books. While many fantasy books focus on kings and lords and knights leading armies and adventures, A Feast for Crows pauses to give us a glimpse into how ordinary people are continuously affected by war and violence. Grim and uneasy, it delves into themes like religion, the nature of evil, identity, and the real cost of war. The heart of the book probably comes when a wandering priest gives his broken men speech, where he describes how any ordinary person can go from good-hearted adventurer to morally gray mercenary to grim-faced outlaw, and finally to dangerous and morally bankrupt broken man. But these broken men should be pitied rather than hated because they are ultimately the product of the impossible choices that war and violence put in front of them. Warfare may appeal to the young and immature, but this book makes a compelling case that war is nothing more than 